Where are you, Josh? Sheva, you don't have to do this. You can still back out. What about you? I've got a personal stake in this. A personal stake? Chris, look around. We should both get the hell out of here. I'm not here just for the mission. What are you talking about? A while back, I received some intel that my old partner was still alive. At first, I didn't know what to think. But when I saw the data file from Delta Team, I knew for sure. Jill is still alive. That woman in the data file? Are you even sure it's the same person? We were partners. I'm sure. Wait! Wait! You're not going alone. Chris, wait! I don't have much time. I have to find her. I'm going with you. These are my people that are dying here. Are you sure about this? A second ago, you were ready to cut and run. I can't just turn my back and walk away. There are no more orders from here on in. It's just us. We are partners. To the end. Now let's get moving. Copy that. Wesker. He was a top official with Umbrella, and the leader of our STARS unit. I met him again after the Raccoon City incident on Rockford Island. Since then, we've been trying to track him down. Then a few years ago, we got a tip from a reliable source. The whereabouts of Umbrella's founder, Oswell E. Spencer. So we paid him a visit, hoping he'd lead us to Wesker. saw in that data looked like her. I have to know if she's still alive. You two were close. We were partners. What about you? Why'd you join the BSAA? My parents were involved in an accident caused by a pharmaceutical company when I was young. Umbrella? Yes. I only found out later that the accident to cover up the manufacturing of biological weapons for terrorists. They we're using Africa as a test bed for their experiments. Bioweapons were responsible for the deaths of my parents. 
And someone has to pay for that. So you joined the BSAA? There's only so much one person can do. Even a superhero like you, Chris. <sighs> I'm no superhero. But together, we can end this. Then let's make a stand for our fallen brothers. Hang on.